Toyota is going all in on the next big leap in electric vehicle technology, solid-state batteries. They're not just making a bet. They're pushing $13.6 billion to the center of the table, aiming to shake up the EV world with game-changing specs, 745 miles of range, 10-minute charging, and batteries that are twice as durable while costing half as much. This isn't some far-fetched startup dream or a theoretical lab experiment. Toyota is making it a reality, with plans to hit the road by 2027. To put that in perspective, 745 miles isn't just an upgrade. It's nearly double the range of today's top-performing EV, the Lucid Air. Imagine driving from New York to Chicago without needing to stop for a recharge. But the real game-changer? A 50% reduction in battery costs. Since batteries make up about 30% of an EV's price tag, this isn't just a step forward. It's a potential knockout punch for competitors still relying on traditional lithium-ion technology. Now, if this sounds too good to be true, you're not alone in thinking that. The EV market is full of flashy promises that never materialize. But this isn't just any company making bold claims. It's Toyota, the same brand that revolutionized hybrids with the Prius. When they move, the entire auto industry feels the shockwaves. So what's behind this breakthrough? The answer is in the name, solid-state batteries. Unlike today's lithium-ion packs that use liquid electrolytes, essentially forcing ions to slog through a thick soup, solid-state batteries swap that liquid for a solid material. The result? Faster ion movement, greater energy density, and vastly improved safety, meaning no more terrifying battery fires. Now, let's geek out for a second. Toyota is likely using sulfide-based solid electrolytes such as lithium-germanium phosphorus sulfide or lithium sulfide. No need to memorize those names. What matters is that these materials allow ions to zip through the battery at speeds exponentially faster than their liquid-based counterparts. It's the kind of breakthrough that could turn the entire EV market on its head. On the cathode side, expect a high nickel composition, possibly NCM811, 80% nickel, 10% cobalt, 10% manganese, or even 90% nickel, allowing for greater energy density. The anode is likely lithium metal, offering theoretical capacities up to 10 times higher than conventional graphite anodes. One of the biggest hurdles Toyota has reportedly overcome is dendrite formation, tiny needle-like structures that can grow from the anode and short-circuit the battery. Their solution likely involves precise control of the solid electrolyte interface, SEI, layer. The manufacturing process itself will be a radical departure from current methods. Instead of winding electrodes and separators into cylindrical or prismatic cells, we're looking at techniques more akin to semiconductor production, think deposition of nanometer-thick layers in highly controlled environments. Less burrito, more layer cake. Now, let's talk numbers. The global EV market is projected to hit 40 million annual sales by 2030, with a total market value approaching $1 trillion. If Toyota brings solid state to market at scale, they could capture a massive slice of that pie. Even a 10% market share would mean 4 million vehicles, more than Toyota's entire global sales in 2021. But solid state isn't just about cars. This tech could revolutionize energy storage for renewables, consumer electronics, and even aerospace. We're talking about a total addressable market in the trillions. Toyota isn't just building a better car, they're potentially reshaping entire industries. Of course, challenges remain. Scaling up production of solid-state batteries is notoriously tricky. The materials are finicky, sensitive to moisture and oxygen. One wrong move and the whole thing collapses. But Toyota isn't backing down. They filed over 8,000 solid-state battery patents in the last three years alone. That's not just throwing darts at a board, that's a coordinated, all-out assault on the problem. They've also partnered with Japanese oil refiner Idemitsu Kozen to scale up production, focusing on sulfide solid electrolytes, potentially the key to mass manufacturing. Now, let's talk market impact. If Toyota delivers, it could send shockwaves through the entire automotive industry. Tesla, long considered the EV leader, could see its technological edge evaporate overnight. Solid-state batteries promise longer lifespans, reducing waste and the need for frequent replacements. They're also potentially easier to recycle. 
Combined with the elimination of cobalt, this aligns perfectly with growing demands for sustainable technology. But Toyota isn't alone in this race. Volkswagen-backed QuantumScape and BMW-partnered Solid Power are also gunning for solid-state supremacy. The next few years will be critical. Toyota aims to begin rolling out these batteries in 2027 to 2028, with mass production ramping up toward 2030. QuantumScape, backed by Volkswagen and Bill Gates, is targeting 2024 to 2025 for initial production. Their stock has been on a wild ride, soaring over $130 in 2020 before crashing back down to under $10 in 2023. Samsung and Panasonic are also in the game. Samsung claims to have developed a viable solid-state battery technology, though their commercialization timeline is unclear. Panasonic, Toyota's current battery partner, is targeting mass production by 2030. Let's not forget China. Giants like CTL and BYD are investing heavily in next-gen batteries. And Toyota's advantage? Deep pockets, $1.55 billion in cash and equivalents as of 2023. Decades of battery experience. A vast patent portfolio. They're not just participating in the race, they're trying to own the track. If they can deliver, it could mark the beginning of the end for internal combustion engines and current EV battery technology alike. We might look back on this as the moment when electric vehicles truly came of age, surpassing their gas-guzzling ancestors in every meaningful metric. The stakes couldn't be higher. We're not just talking about the future of one company or even one industry. This is about the future of energy storage and transportation at large. It's about reshaping our cities, our power grids, and our relationship with energy. For investors, this presents both enormous opportunities and significant risks. Toyota, as a diversified automaker, offers a relatively safe way to bet on solid-state tech. Pure play companies like QuantumScape offer higher potential returns but with much greater risk. Their success or failure hinges entirely on the viability of their solid-state technology. In conclusion, Toyota's solid-state battery initiative isn't just another product development. It's a potential paradigm shift. The company that perfects this technology won't just dominate the automotive industry, they'll hold the keys to powering our entire world. The race is on, the stakes are astronomical, and Toyota has just taken the lead. So buckle up, folks. The next few years are going to be one hell of a ride. The EV revolution is about to hit hyperdrive, and solid-state batteries are the nitrous boost. Welcome to the future. It's going to be electrifying.